when I open up a molecule in Chimera X, it defaults to this ribbon representation, which isn't helpful when we're trying to make measurements and we need to be able to click on actual atoms. So the way to do this with nucleotides is to first um, open the structure, and then you can click on the nucleotides tab here and select plane and that will show your atoms of your bases. If you want to show the backbone atoms, you would go up to the actions menu, select atoms and bonds, and then you'd say backbone only, and that shows the backbone atoms, and then if we go to actions, atoms, bonds, show side chain base. Now we see all of the atoms in our system, and we can make measurements on them. Now to measure a distance, we can go up to the Tools menu and select Structure Analysis and select Distances. In the bottom right of our screen, the Structure Measurements box will pop up. So let's say I wanted to measure the length of this helix. I would select the top Atom, an atom at the top. So I'm going to change my right mouse click to be select. I'm going to click on one atom at the top, and then I would hold the shift key down and right click on an atom at the bottom. Or, oops, if I can, I'm going to click and drag over it to select it. And then I will say create to measure that distance. And so the dialog box tells me the distance, but you'll also see that there is a label there. I can zoom in and, and see it. And you can play around with the display of this label if you were making a figure where you wanted to show the distances. But uh, I'm just interested in what the distance actually is. So the distance of this helix from top to bottom, or at least from the atoms I measured, is 42.642 angstrom.